Hey, Aotearoa New Zealand is becoming known for inventing some pretty exciting tech. Tonight, in the third of our Changemakers series for 2021, supported by Dell, we're meeting inventor Dudley Jackson, and he's solved a problem that 25% of New Zealanders suffer from. Dudley Jackson did what many of us only dream of. He quit work to sail around the world with his family. Sold my house, bought a yacht, children aboard, even the dog and we went sailing into the sunset. Sailor, sailor, sailor. But as soon as they hit rough seas, Dudley discovered he suffers from seasickness. And we couldn't leave the sheltered waters of New Zealand. He went back to working in IT. Back on terra firma, he discovered something else that made him unwell. My son introduced me to virtual reality and I was shocked how quickly I got motion sickness. This got him thinking. If virtual reality can make me sick so quickly, if we reverse some of the engineering in it, could it remove seasickness just as quickly? And the answer is yes. It took years of tweaking and more motion sickness before he finally cracked it. To alleviate seasickness, you need to look at a natural horizon. Sea level provides that even when you're inside the vessel. You're transported off the boat back onto land again. Virtual reality land. Dudley's invention has helped many others, like Captain Chris Coleman. Being seasick is uh, not good in our job. Rio de Janeiro, Littleton pilot launch, good morning. As marine pilot at Littleton Port, Chris is responsible for safely guiding some pretty big ships into the harbour. I get on board the ship and then bring the ship down the channel, put the ship on the berth and in the correct position. So you don't want to mess it up? No. After being on boats for much of his life, Chris only started suffering from seasickness a few years ago. Already, on, on this nice day, I'm starting to overheat, so if you are feeling seasick, that um, just makes things a lot worse. As soon as I put the headset on and re-established the horizon, I felt a lot better. Once I've climbed up the ladder and the bridge door opens... Morning. For me, it's showtime. There's no time to feel ill. Dudley found that a quick burst on the headset didn't work for everyone, so he started collecting data from a variety of boats under different weather conditions. With sea level, we introduced that movement into a virtual reality scene. It's designed for longer stints at sea, and it was inspired by an old tradition. An old trick that many sailors use is they go and sleep on their boat for a few days before they go out to the ocean. By introducing that boat's particular movement slowly, it trains the body to accept that movement over time. This is new technology, but we see in a few years' time this being mainstream technology where every vessel in the medical bay has got a VR device to remove seasickness. Wow, isn't that cool? Yeah. Really, really cool, and hopefully that's just the beginning. Dudley's also working on car sickness and making some great progress there as well. Hopefully drivers don't use that one. <laughs> <laughs> For his great contribution, Dudley has won an XPS laptop courtesy of Dell. And if you know of anyone who's inspiring change in their community and you want to nominate them, go along to our Facebook page.